Hey romance readers! Welcome back to Adora R. Linda here coming back at you with another video today. Happy Saturday! I hope everyone's having a great Saturday. Uh, today, um, I know I mentioned in my last video that I was going to do some uh, Kindle books. And that's what I've got for you today. Show you what's on my Kindle. I'll go through a few of these. And if any of you've read any of these, let me know what you thought about them. Because some of these, uh, I just downloaded a sample. Like you can read the first chapter and you, you know, you can tell if you want to read it or not. That's what I like about ebooks. You can download and read a free sample. And if you don't like it, yeah, you can just delete it. Yeah. <laughs> so the first book I have is by R.J. Prescott. I don't know if any of you read her. I read her Hurricane book. It was a sports romance. It was fan freaking fantastic. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed her writing. So I said, well, let me try out. She just came out with this book. Uh, this is not a sports romance. This is just like a regular romance story. I think it's going to be like kind of a... Um, I think the guy's in the military or something like that. It's called City Under Siege. And I thought I'd give it a try since I liked Hurricane so much. Uh, and I'll read you a little bit of the synopsis here. Let me find the synopsis. Um, if I can get it together. Okay. Lundy is a city in flames. Tensions are high and a critical situation is about to go from bad to worse. The Prime Minister wants to send a message and the SAS will be the ones to deliver it. Emotional detachment is my specialty. I am ruthless and cutthroat, but there is nobody better. Sarah, Sarah Tatum is an innocent, caught up in a world in which she doesn't belong and trying desperately to do the right thing. My job is to keep her safe long enough to get what's needed and bring an end to this siege of terror. But something has changed. I've learned that the only thing stronger than loyalty is love. And now she's gone. My name is Lieutenant Tom Harper and I'm about to unleash hell. <laughs> when I read that, I was like, okay, go on, unleash hell on them. I was like, uh... Yeah, I got to check this out. Now, I bought this one. Some of my download as a sample, but I bought this one. Like I said, I liked her first book, Hurricane. So, I know she's a good writer. So, I went ahead and um, uh, purchased this one. And it's City Under Siege by R.J. Prescott. Have any of you tried this out? Let me know. I think I mentioned, if any of you uh, read any of these books, um, let me know what you thought about them. Uh, next I have is uh, J.C. Burton, uh, Shot on Goal. Uh, I've read some of her sports romance and this is sports romance. And this is what I want to, I only downloaded a sample of this one um, to check it out. Because this is about the Olympics and I like Olympic romances. So I just, uh, I didn't purchase it. I wanted just, because some of her books like are, are hit or miss for me. Yeah. So I was like, let's just let me sample this one and see what's going on with this. I'll read you a little bit of uh, the synopsis on this one. And uh, I think this is with her play to play by play. I think this is a play by play. this is a series play by play series. And like it say in the new play by play novel novel by New York Times bestselling author of the final score opposite of the track when a figure skater and hockey player lace up their skates and go for the goal. So when I said it's a, when I found out it's going to be a hockey player and she figure skates and it's about Olympic, yeah. I started to go ahead and purchase this, but I was like, let me make sure. Like I said, I've read some of her books, some of them I like and some of them I didn't. Uh, let me read the synopsis on this. And, and it's a play by play. I think this is like some serious, she don't write quite a few uh, sports romances and I guess it's like a play by play, the play by play series. Uh, Will Mad Dog Ma Madigan is making his second trip to the Winter Olympics and he couldn't be happier. Hockey is his life and playing for the U.S. team is a pri privilege. Then he meets U.S. figure skater Amber Sloan. She's beautiful, ambitious, and driven. Everything Will desires in a woman. He would love to show Amber how hot life off the ice can be. So I was like, yeah, that sounds interesting. So I hope I, when I read the, uh, and I'll probably get this in book form if I want to purchase it because this is $9.99 ebook. Come on, people. Why? Not for ebook? Yeah, not happening. So if I really, when I read the uh, 
couple of chapters and I really like it, I'll just go ahead and just buy the I'll just buy the whole book because I'm not gonna buy pay $9.99 for an ebook. It's not happening. Not with me, it's not. <laughs> Next up I have is um I gotta learn how to work this candle it's doing too much. I'm trying to get the uh, picture here. Where is it? Next book is a uh, cage. And it's by Shea Savage. And uh, I think this is going to be about wrestling. Take down. I guess it's this. Yeah, it's going to be a series. Take down. Take down Teague. A take down Teague or something like that. Um, I guess that's the name of the series. Take down Teague. Um, let me read you a little bit of this. This is not made for TV. This is raw, brutal, underground of no holes barred combat. Inside the cage, there is nothing but me and the pain I inflict on those who dare enter. In the cage, I never have to worry about anyone but myself. Yet, when she began standing outside of the cage, everything changed. I was no longer fighting for the money or the glory. I was fighting for her. So I was like, yeah, I like underground fighting um, sports romances too. And yeah, I was like, let me try this out. I only downloaded a sample because I I think I don't think I've ever read anything by Shea Savage. So I was like, let me sample that. So that's a sample. Uh, next up I have uh, is Crack Kingdom. I think I mentioned on here, I read this. This is the uh, Royal series. I read all four books. I really enjoyed them, especially uh, book four. And this is the... Um, the uh, book four was on the third brother. I forgot what his name is. And I really enjoyed the third book. So this is the book five. of uh, It ended on a cliffhanger. So this is book five of the second brother uh, end of his story, I guess. Um, Crack Kingdom. I haven't read it yet. And I did go ahead and purchase this one. And I'll read you a little bit of um, the synopsis of this. These royals will ruin you. Like I mentioned, it's the royal series and the, the guy's last name is Royal. Uh, ever since Harley Wright met Eastern Royal, her life hasn't been the same. There are enemies behind every corner and danger beyond each door. When tragedy strikes and steals her memory, she can't trust anyone. Not even the blue-eyed boy who promised her that everything will be alright. So I had to get this one and it, like I said, this is the fifth book in the series and it's on the second brother. It's the second part to the fourth book uh, of in the Royal series. So it's Crack Kingdom. I haven't read it yet. Can't wait to read it. I don't know about this cover though. I, li I, uh, enjoy I like the first, uh, uh, the other covers on the other four book, but this one with the, the chair, I don't know. What you think? <laughs> And let's see what else I got on here. You know, I had to get some uh, Mariana Zapata. I like her. She's an excellent writer. Um, let me find the uh, cover here for you. It's uh, from Loco. Lo maybe this is about somebody who's Russian or uh, from overseas, Germany or something. From Lou Cove with Love. I guess that's how I'm pronouncing that right. But it's Mariana Zapata. Uh, so I had to get this. I also purchased this one. Because uh, I like her writing also. Um, let me read a little bit of the synopsis. If someone were to ask Jasmine St. Toast. To describe the last few years of her life. With a single word. It would definitely it would definitely be a four letter one. After 17 years and countless broken bones and broken promises, she knows her window to com compete in figure skating is coming to a close. But when the offer of a lifetime comes in from an arrogant idiot she spent the last decade dreaming about pushing in the way of a moving bus, Jasmine might be Jasmine might have to reconsider everything. So that's on that. I guess she, this is going to be about figure skating. And I guess the, the guy she's talking about, maybe he's a figure skater too or or something like that. But it don't say. But she said, an offer of a lifetime come from, from an arrogant idiot. She spent the last decade dreaming about pushing in the way of a moving bus. So I guess they don't get along. So I guess he figure skates too. It does say. But I can't wait to check that out. And it's dealing with figure skating. So I was like, hey, I hope it's good from Luke. 
Luke Vo with Love. I like that cover. It's cute. And I just got one more here. Uh, I'll share with you. Uh, let me see here. It's, um, this is the hookup. I read this. I really enjoyed it. And this is also a series, the Game On series by Kristen Callahan. I really, I liked it. Uh, it's about, uh, it's a YA because, um, the characters, they are still in college. And it was pretty good. Um, I ain't gonna say it was fan-freaking-tastic for me, but I really enjoyed it. And, uh, I will probably read it again. And I'll read you a, um little synopsis of this the rules no kissing on the mouth no staying the night no telling anyone and above all no falling in love Anna Jones just wants to finish college and figure out her life falling for star quarterback Drew Baylor is certainly not on her certainly not on her to-do list confident and charming he lives in the limelight and is way too gorgeous for his own good if only she could ignore his heated stares and stop thinking about doing hot and dirty things with him. Easy, right? Too bad he's committed. Too bad he's committed to making her break every rule. I enjoyed the book. Like I said, it. I enjoyed it. I liked it, but it wasn't like when I finished it, I was like, wow. It was a good read. I did enjoy it. The character was okay. Um, so I would recommend you check it out. Um, I know a lot of people on YouTube and, and um, it got good ratings on uh, Amazon. So check it out. Let me know what you thought about it. Did you really, was it fan freaking tastic for you? It's The Hookup by Christian Callahan. And it's a series. I'm thinking about uh, reading the rest of the series. I don't know yet. I might, I think I downloaded another book from there. Uh, but it was only a sample, but I haven't read it yet. But I'll show that to you next time. That's all I have for you now. So continue to enjoy your Saturday. And I'll see you again next week. Uh, you know what I'm going to say? Keep reading those romances. Have a fantastic day. Bye.